namo tassa bhagavato arahato samma sambuddhassa namo tassa bhagavato arahato samma sambuddhassa namo tassa bhagavato arahato samma sambuddhassa so the today is the sixth day of the intensive meditation program already we completed six days few more days remain for us we should maintain this meditation object continuously have to maintain if anyone maintain meditation object they can convert their life they can convert their complete their life you know the before the meditation bodily no comfortable before the meditation the uh, mentally also no comfortable bodily many pains but uh, when you are training your meditation object continuously you feel body is uh, body become more comfortable all the pain disappear mentally all the difficulties disappear because of the meditation object the meditation object can convert your life when you are converting our life we need to train it continuously it is very important focus in meditation object continuously as much as possible it is very important we determine one hour i should maintain this meditation object one hour we maintain if one hour work another one hour in the one now determination together we maintain then gradually your meditation power become better and better so meditators their responsibility bring their mind to the meditation object so if any one train they can have the bodily comfortableness mentally also very comfortable and also later they get the some brightness not only that they get the absorption jhanas so jhanas also they can train up to the eight jhanas vipassana also they can train up to the wisdom deeper level and train up to the attainment path portions so meditations we can train up to that level so that meditation object can do this work but uh, meditators they have to do it correct way when they are doing it if they are do very hardly they never experience meditation deep results if they do not energy also cannot do we need middle energy general energy so general energy together you maintain your meditation object definitely you can have the deep results most of the meditators beginning they not understand our practice they think they aiming liberation that is good but liberation is last resort that uh, first aim we should keep second aim third aim fourth aim we should keep different aims first aim to attain liberation i have to prepare my mind for continuous meditation object this is the first aim we should keep we prepare our mind and training continuously meditation object so one hour can another one hour can so whole day can so when you are doing it second stage of the your meditation you get little bit brightness or oh, how to stabilize so the second stage is little bit tranquility comfortableness how to stabilize maintain continuously meditation object it is stabilized third stage little bit brightness you maintain continuously meditation object brightness also can stabilize fourth stage absorption jhanas so then you get little bit then determine and practice continuously meditation object your absorption your jhanas come can train up to the eight jhanas so then the wisdom is more better now then determine and train wisdom vipassana when you are training your wisdom level go deep and deep you go up to the attainment level so step by step so understanding one they train step by step first step is bring meditation object continuously 
so maybe they is called boy or girl or pupils if they are in the grade one they are thinking university level or degree level they never get it they should know that they are going to this journey but their main aim is not that one main aim is go to the first class to the second class grade one to grade two so grade one grade two then grade two to grade three gradually they are that the grade two grade upgrading finally they come to the they are the goal the expecting places same way meditators they are thinking liberation they never achieve so that they have to think it but they have to think that to go to the liberation we have to get to upgrade grade grade one then the second one grade two grade three then only final liberation come so meditators main responsibility is bring meditation object and maintain it if anyone do it definitely life is converted because your karma become better meditation object can build up your good karma your karma become more better now with the meditation object when the karma is strongest you can have some of the calmness comfortableness brightness jhanas all these things getting better and better your parami also getting better and better because of the meditation object so it is very important to maintain meditation object continuously when you are training you have to do the balance way without forcing it if you force and do less result if you are not effortful also less result we maintain meditation object generally continuously then definitely that your life is getting converted that you can have the deeper meditation results so we know how enable they are more effortful already many experience all the devotees meditators also already experience so we wish all of you to continue this practice and also increase your practice and go up your practice with the great to great and finally fulfill all the concentrations fulfill all the vipassanas and wish all of you to train this meditation practice until you attain all the path fruition and nibbana so the meditation practice we know we have to maintain meditation object it is one thing when you are maintaining we determine every hour we determine and maintain then gradually you can experience deeper deeper meditation results it is very important to maintain continuous practice so that after some times you can see your life is converted because of the meditation object can do very big work very big conversions so that in order we have to practice then definitely good results we remind one of the dharma story in the buddha time useful story so that for us to have some dharma energies also you know the buddha time buddha mainly stay in the shravatte jetvana monastery some are there around a little bit away one village the one of the the ascetic they had been living his name is patika ajivak the ascetic had been living there in this village somewhere one family that do some service to him as like the family member one mother and son they are living in the family mother treat him as like the son every time come they are eating and also mother also get some advice from him very close family so that patika also always very close to the family so that one day the villagers go to the jetavana monastery to listen dham so when they see lord buddha when they hear from the buddha they got inspiring motivations energies because you know the buddha is become completely different to the other ascetics reason is buddha is parame power you know the buddha in the lay life time also king king siddhartha and also after enlightenment also king the buddha king 
we call the king for the whole universe. So that when somebody see with the pages of the Buddha also motivations. You can see nowadays when we see very beautiful Buddha image, also we feel more energy. If you see real Buddha, how much energy you get? Because Buddha has so much compassion, so much energy in the Buddha's life. So these devotees go to the Buddha and see Buddha, got more faith, listen to Dharma from the Buddha, so then they undertook more valuable Dharma. After listening to this Dharma, they all come back to the village. And now all the time talking about Buddha and preaching. That mother also got to know about it. Mother who treat for this party Ajivaka also got to know that villagers go there, villagers more inspiring of the Buddha's teaching. She also wanted to go. So one day she told to that Ajivaka because Ajivaka always advised his mother so without telling him no good to go. Mother Te said, I want to go to Buddha place for listen to them. Oh, that Ajivaka avoid, don't, don't go there. That uh, it is not suitable to go there, not necessary to go there. He is telling various things and he stopped mother. After a few days, again mother asked, again same thing, he avoid mother go there. Few times it happened. Then mother understand that uh, together with permission of him, I never can go. I will do something. That I uh, ask son, son, I want to see the Buddha. I want to listen to Dharma from the Buddha. Please go to the Jetavana monastery and invite Buddha on behalf of me. If I wanted to go, this Ajiva cannot allow me to go. So the son says, Yes, Mother, I can do it. The son also, that before going to the Jetavana monastery, go to this Ajivaka's monastery. It's called that hermitage. So go there and said, oh, that Ajivaka, O oh, Patika, I am going to Jetavana monastery to invite Buddha tomorrow, Dhana, and preach in Dhamma. The Ajivaka says, don't go there. Don't go there. If you go there, it is not suitable. Son said, Ajivaka, I cannot stop it. If I stop, if I not go there, my mother get angry with me, I get some punishment. I have to go there. Okay, then I will tell something, some way. What is the way to invite Buddha? When the people listen to Dhamma, they go away. That time, you just go in to the Buddha, just say that mother is inviting for next day dana. Don't tell the place where is the correct place, don't tell it. Just come out to with the people. So that the boy said, oh, yes, that one I can do. Then says, oh yes, your mother cooking very good food for Buddha. That food we can eat because Buddha not coming. So we can eat, you and me can eat. So the boy said, yes, I do it. Boy also go there. When the people listen, Dhamma, go away, just go to the Buddha and say, Bhante, my mother inviting to Morodhan. So just tell him it and he come out. Actually, Buddha no need to tell the place. If Buddha need to go there, Buddha like to go there, wherever Buddha can go. Even this Ravati or any place, any far away, Buddha can see it. Because Buddha's parami is not the small amount. Because Buddha's parami during the, the eons, that eons uh, Asankaya four plus one hundred thousand, so long a period had been completing. When Buddha came to the Bodhi tree, he had been fulfilling his practice uh, without uh, going to the wrong directions. Now how can go to the wrong direction? Because Buddha already completed his practice. Even very far also Buddha can see. You know the one occasion, Anatha Pindika's daughter, she was in far away, 120 ojanas away. She wanted to invite Buddha. She invited him, Buddha from 120 ojanas. He spread some flower to the sky and invite Buddha. 
those flowers come to the Buddha. So then uh, the Buddha understood this invitation. Next day, Buddha appeared there. So like that, any place Buddha can go. So this place also boy not explain, but uh, Buddha know where the place. So Buddha slowly walk in the morning. Buddha can come by the psychic power or any of the way Buddha can come. But Buddha is generally come in the walking to the mother's place. Mother also prepare very special nutritious dana and also special decorations, special fragrance, flowers and other very beautiful things, various beautiful things. You know, this is traditionally in the foot mat and foot uh, path, also very decorated one and also above, like the umbrellas also above, also covering in the decorative things. So this is mother everything, very beautiful, respectful thing. Hartika also think should go to this house because Buddha not coming no. Buddha don't know how to come, Buddha not come. Food we can eat. Now Hartika also go to the house and he stay inside the room. Buddha come in time. Buddha know how to come, but time, Buddha come in time. People also prepare for offering. So when the, the Buddha come, everyone very respectfully receive Buddha and prepare Buddha sitting and offer Buddha dhan. Buddha also finish dhan. After that, he start preaching some dhamma, general dhamma. Mother also very respectful now to the Buddha. When she was listening to dhamma, naturally she was saying sadhu, sadhu. That every stop she is saying sadhu, sadhu. So because her faith is very strong now. From that time, the party came inside the room. He had been tolerating, tolerating, tolerating. He cannot tolerate now. Immediately, blast. He got very strong, angry, come there. And many people there, Buddha there, blame into the Buddha, blame into this mother, blame into the other people. And while blaming, he ran away. But the Buddha didn't stop Dhamma talk. Buddha had been continued with Dhamma talk. But no mother not saying now sadhu. Buddha know that mother got mentality some difficulties. Then Buddha stop and says, Mother, I understand your mentality is changed. Yes, Bhante. Early I had been very, very respectful listening to this Dhamma. Because of these particles, the things, my mentality, now agitations. Not easy focus in the Buddha's teaching. So Buddha says, others blaming, others harmful things, don't focus. Others doing wrong things, don't focus. That so you focus your things, what you've done, what you've not done. This thing only you focus, saying it. Buddha preach one Dhammapada verse, it comes from the Dhammapada, Puppavag, flower section. Buddha preach one Dhammapada verse, the very simple one. Napare sang vilomani, napare sang kata katang, atanova avekeya katani akatani chate. Very small Dhammapada verse. So this topic together both the preach dhamma. In this topic both the explaining others harmful things to me, others that are harmful thing for their uh, life, don't reflect, don't think. You are good and you are bad things, you reflect. So Buddha had been preaching this Dhamma. Here in this verse, valuable thing for us also to correct ourselves. When she was listening to the Dhamma, her mentality go again very deep level, concentration appear, so that uh, vipassana power also appear. On the same time, she could attain stream entry sotapan. Other many also had been listening to the Dhamma. Many of them could attain some path portions. So in the Dhamma, some of the valuable thing for us, we will explain later. So the. On that day, the particle, 
he blamed to this uh, buddha and also the other people and go away so mother had been thinking the worrying it buddha advised her not to worrying of others actually that we have to correct our mind we have to focus everything at the world in natures so this also world in nature world we cannot avoid this kind of thing negative thing that we have to correct our mind you know the worldly many people they have the weaknesses some are they are fighting some are they are blaming some are doing wrong thing if you are thinking this kind of thing we never can develop sometimes our family own family father is wrong to us done bad thing to us mother done bad thing to us sometimes family brothers sisters relatives neighbors so many thing can happen in the world even though we should not focus there on this thing there on this thing if we focus it you cannot develop your mind to develop your mind you should not think it some people in the world they are doing wrong thing we are, we are focusing why this people doing we person doing wrong thing also we never develop our mind to develop our mind it is very important to focus ourselves not others you can focus your mind see from the morning until evening not in the retreat period other time you can see majority of your thinking is thinking this person wrong this one wrong this one bad this one bad so we cannot develop our mind because of this kind of wrong thinking this wrong thinking we call wrong attitude or we call mitcha sankalp mitcha sankalp never develop your mind we have to convert it in the word we know samma sankalp is called nikkama sankalp avyapada sankalp avihita sankalp we know it this is literally we know in the book we know actually practically is what is uh, right thinking right thoughts without right thinking without right thoughts you never can develop this path it is very important so nekam we know our aiming to the liberation is nekam avyapada means we cannot have the hated mind to the worldly beings avihisa means uh, we should not have the harmful mind to the worldly beings that means good mind you have to maintain you have to maintain good mind that means loving kindness mind and uh, compassion mind and also focus on your liberation mind those thing you maintain this is right thinking this is very important without having this focusing you never can uh, go to the deeper level if you maintain it uh, your practice also very comfortable development also very fast your karma also become better so that your life is more and more comfortable better you know the buddha got various think this kind of thing even though buddha didn't react anything devadatta done many thing to buddha because buddha so innocent one buddha never done any harm to the world so that the useful one to the world but devadatt done some against things to buddha buddha never tell any words against to buddha devadatt buddha is still compassion so like that harmful people outside people they are harmful to the good one but the good one they are tolerating good one they are maintaining their good mind they are that life getting more and more shining life become more and more better because of these harmful things you know the in this time the the particle come and blame to the buddha but the buddha never anything buddha never react so buddha's quality for coming up they were that done harmful thing to the buddha buddha never any react so that people more talking about buddha quality so buddha become more and more brighter buddha become more and more shining buddha life because of the seeing buddha's patient fullness for example we think here one venerable 
and the vendable come and blame to this vendable or that some harmful thing to the vendable is generally other vendable also harmful other vendable also try to blame try to harmful this is general another vendable maybe someone come and blaming and assault but is still tolerating so those vendables uh, fame become more and more oh this vendable very special very valuable vendable even someone blame even someone assault vendable never change is still vendable keep smiling keep good mind so valuable vendable everyone talking it so like that we also train someone in the world definitely wrong one they are doing wrong thing we cannot avoid it in the world but we still maintain our good mentality for them compassion mentality for them so life become better and better here in the forest we are thinking we are in the forest no harmful to others we are practicing in forest actually that is true even though some thing come to us nowadays very less may be for you but you cannot stay all the time here one day you go out and do some sasana work or some dharma work cannot avoid it this kind of a thing in buddhist background lesser but non buddhist background more cannot avoid it some blame some assault some of things but you have to tolerate you have to focus your mind you have to still keep compassion you have to still keep the loving kindness for them this mentality is you have to correct without correcting this mentality if we develop meditation very less use we are developing meditation but very less use you know that in the street it time you are very good your meditation very good concentration very good after it treat this kind of thing happen your emotion calm so your meditation power all gone if you maintain this kind of mentality is together right attitude together right uh, mind together you maintain this retreat period you also you are developing after retreat also very easily maintain your meditation energies so training mind not to see others weaknesses others ill of others one of the venerable previous before told me venerable sir i determine i never talk ill of others i determine i never done it after determinations so anyone any wrong thing any mistake i never talk it i determine it's very good thing we also can determine we also can determine oh if not we talk this venerable one wrong this one wrong this one wrong it is our feeling we then determine not to talk not to think others weaknesses we have many weaknesses we have to see our weaknesses so that in the next word buddha says see our weaknesses and our good things and correct ourselves so the next word is put explaining our own thing we have to reflect our own weaknesses and also on good things some of us we have the weaknesses we have to focus and correct it some of us we have the good things good things we have to develop this focusing very important so in our single way we are calling that our internal very big thing we cannot focus external small thing we can focus we can understand you know our country we have coconut coconut fibers small fibers and also coconut rafters also there very big rafters for roofing so that internally you have you i got coconut rafter others i got coconut fiber you see others coconut fiber but you can't see your coconut rafter means you understand internally you have very big weaknesses you can't see it externally some outsiders they have very small weaknesses you can see it so this is the nature of our mind this is the nature of our life because we are our mind trained to see outside mind trained not to see the ourselves when we focus others weaknesses other thing we have to focus with i have this one actually have a little bit someone fighting so that we have to focus to i i have yes time time i also have some are angry oh i think this person angry i have to focus yes i also time time get angry 
someone craving you have to focus yourself also i also have so this way we have to focus ourselves correct ourselves it is the way correcting ourselves this is the thing our buddha says so the samma sankalpa right thoughts is very important without right thoughts without correcting our mind journey is very difficult noble eight fold path development very weak and so one of the very important for is uh, this right thoughts samma sankalpa we have to train that uh, right thoughts so then journey is very fast you are very easily develop concentration easily develop mindfulness easily wisdom easily attainments so that we determine and train continuously loving kindness continuously compassion compassion continuously tolerations we determine and train anyone blame me i tolerate anyone hit me i tolerate anyone doing bad thing to me i tolerate so this kind of training we have to train then there this kind of thing happen one day very easy you to tolerate so sometimes you lost something but you are shiny maybe someone come and crop you something you get lost but that others talking oh this entrepreneur this one very special because uh, that uh, your quality they more respectful you more support you because of the this uh, right thinking so it is very important so we know our vendors all of us we are more effortful more practice we are more correct in ourselves further we determine and correct ourselves and our weaknesses we try to completely give up so we wish all the vendors to continue this practice fulfill your mindful practice fulfill your wisdom practice fulfill your concentration practice wish all of you attain for the path process and nirvana tervans karai wish you the merits idango nyate nango to sukita antu nyatayo idango nyate nango to sukita antu nyatayo idango nyate nango to sukita antu nyatayo etavata chame sambatam punya sampadam सबे देवानुमोद सब संपत्ति सिद्धिया सबे भूतानुमोद सब संपत्ति सिद्धिया सबे सत्तानुमोद सब संपत्ति सिद्धिया आकाशट्टा चुम्मट्टा देवाकमिका पुण्यतंगनुमोद्वा चिंगु संबुद्ध शासन चिंगु संबुद्ध देश चिंगु संबुद्ध सवक चिंगु मं पर अस्में विहारे चरामे अतिवत्ता चेवता अनुमोदी मं पुण्यं रखु जिन शासन सबे सत्ता च मज्जत्ता चिता च मे अनुमोदी मं पुण्य भज्जन तो अम संपद इमिना पुण्य कमे न मे बाल सगम सतन सगम हो तो यवनिबाण पतिया इमिना पुण्य कमे न मे बाल सगम सतन सगम हो तो यवनिबाण पतिया इमिना पुण्य कमे न मे बाल सगम सतन सगम हो तो यवनिबाण पतिया इमाय धम्मुम पटिपतिया बुद्ध पूजे मे इमाय धम्मुम पटिपतिया धम्म पूजे मे इमाय धम्मुम पटिपतिया संगम पूजे मे अध्याय माय पटिपतिया जाति जरा मरण परिमुंचिषा काये न वाचा चित्तेन पमाधेन मया कथम अच्छयांकम मे बंते भूरी पंच तथागत काये न वाचा चित्तेन पमाधेन मया कथम अच्छयांकम मे धम्म संडिटिका कालिक 
कायन वाचा चित्तेन पमादेन मया कथम अच्छयांक मे संग पुण्य कृत अनुतर साधु साधु साधु